hottest things in Hollywood apparently right now. It was even a treatment offered in the Oscar gift bag this year. It's called a vampire breast lift. You heard that right, a mm -hmm. vampire breast lift. Okay. It sounds bizarre, but that actual procedure gives women a way to boost their breasts without having to undergo the knife. No surgery is involved. News 8's medical reporter Jocelyn Mementa explains how this new enhancing technique works. The number of Americans contemplating cosmetic procedures is increasing, and many are looking for less invasive alternatives. Now, this one enhances breast without surgery. We're going to recline you. No breast implants for Lynn Siegel. I wanted to enhance my breast, but I didn't want to be anything invasive. After having children and age, they just uh, weren't like they used to be. Instead, she's undergoing a non-invasive breast enhancement at Ultimate Solutions Medical Spa. It gives you an illusion of a breast lift. Internist Dr. Jennifer Jose is also trained and certified in anti-aging treatments. She targets the inflated area lost to aging and childbirth using two primary products. First, an injectable collagen filler is fanned in to initiate volume. The Bellafil uh, is a long-term filler. It lasts about five to seven years. Then platelet-rich plasma is infused. It's good for healing because there's a lot of growth factors that, that are found in the platelets. The PRP was separated from blood drawn earlier from Lynn. And then when you put the platelet-rich plasma over it, it actually stimulates more collagen and then it will volumize it even more. Dr. Jose says this procedure is mostly for women who've had children. Her tool of choice is a cannula, which makes small punctures so there is no bleeding. I thought it was going to hurt. Painless, absolutely no pain. This could take at least an hour to complete. There's no downtime. There's no losing of work. And the gratification is instant. This is Lynn before. This is Lynn immediately after. So far, so good. And it's just going to get better. Like most cosmetic procedures, this is not covered by insurance. It can cost between three to $5,000. The PRP phase will need to be repeated in 12 to 14 months. That is an added cost. For more information, head to our website, WTNH.com. Back to you.